tightest things in the world. Hey guys, I am back. I am in Virginia on my home time, which ends tomorrow. So I'm getting the truck ready for tomorrow, heading to New Jersey. I have a load behind the <clears throat> in the trailer. Um, but yeah, here's the driveway that um, my family customized to fit in the truck, which is pretty cool. They put rocks all the way around and then coming out hopefully i can get out tomorrow if i make it more to the left and then turn right so i won't hit that sign in the morning which i think i should be all right the way i'm looking at it but yeah it's pretty cool uh just cleaned the truck out i did have mice in the truck which one of my traps did get the mouse there were two mice in there, but one of them I got out. The other one was still roaming around, but that's the one I caught yesterday. So hopefully I shouldn't have any more mice in the truck, but I still have some traps laid out just in case for uh, future uh, infestations. But yeah, it's pretty cool though. Came down here and then just kind of went rolled inside and it worked just fine. A little bit of the plastic plate in the bottom scraping, but I th that should be all right. Um, but uh, yeah, so uh, we'll get rolling tomorrow, and I will see you guys in New Jersey. Well, hopefully everybody is doing well. I just made my delivery, and look at that. You can see New York right in front of me. Like the sun is rising from behind us so you can see like the layout of all the buildings and stuff like that. That's really cool. Let's slow down. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm gonna pick up another delivery here in New Jersey <clears throat> and head to uh, mile, South left. Carolina. Super early to make that delivery, which buddy, you let me go. What are we doing? Oh my God! Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, I need to get out of this before it starts getting more congested with cars. I can imagine driving this every morning. Uh, it would suck. The reason why I got up so early and got here, because there's no cars in the road at like four in the morning. But yeah, hopefully everybody's doing really well. They had a uh, good Christmas with their family. Cause I sure did. I had a lot of food and stuff. I ended up getting sick though, which I'm still recovering from it. I don't know, I got like a cold or something. My nose has been running and had a fever, but now I'm kind of getting better. Just uh, have a lot of mucus. As it was, it's coming up. We gotta go to New Jersey Turnpike. Like that's right. really neat.
trade because I do not want to miss this turn up here. That would be no bueno. I think that's like an indoor like, like ice skating building. That's what it looks like. Uh, wait a minute, what? Wait, is this it? This is it. America Dream. I'd like to go there. Looks like a big theme park. Has like a water park in there. Alright, what are we doing? Turn over here. Slow down. Slow my ass down. Life Stadium. driving through these things, these tolls. <laughs> there are some really tight ones too. Now keep uh, right. Keep right, yeah, we're going south. <sighs> yeah, but it was nice seeing family. I didn't get to see, obviously, see my parents because they're in South Florida. But it is what it is. I got them gifts and stuff like that. when I get close to the shipper. See ya. All right, guys. I am here at the shipper. Um, It's called High Life. I guess it must be like t-shirts or something um, because I'm heading to the Ross distribution in South Carolina. I think Fort Mill, South Carolina, if I'm not mistaken. And I am going to... drop this load off there which I've been there before I was just looking it up on a GPS and yeah I've been there so be my first place I've been a second time as a trucker um that place isn't so bad last time I couldn't really find a true well I guess it wasn't that bad um but yeah I'm going to get this load and head to a loves to fill up and after I fill up, I'm gonna head to Rich, the Richmond Terminal, and um, hopefully I should be there by eh, three o'clock, maybe three-ish. Hopefully before four, so then I can go talk to my driver later, just to say hi, ask a question. Um, but other than that, I am feeling a lot better, but still feeling like poo. Uh, it's warming up from the sun right now, but it's cold outside. We're talking, I don't know. I think the last time I saw it was like 28 degrees outside. Ugh, it's cold. 
Oh, it's 42 now. But, yep. Nothing too adventurous has really happened. But once I get to Rich and Terminal, I will, uh, I'll get back, back with you guys. I'll see you guys there. Alright, hey guys, I am in Baltimore. Almost to the Terminal. So, I remember the first time going through here, it was pretty cool. Um, they have a big tunnel that goes underneath the, I guess the harbor or the bay, which that's crazy that they built a tunnel underneath the bay and ships go over it. But they have something similar like that in uh, Fort Lardo, but not at this scale. This one's a lot bigger. Let's see. Just gonna watch my speed. Uh, it's 55 through here. It's all the T1 attacks, he's sitting in the middle, just looking to get somebody. Uh, oh my god. Yeah, here's good old Baltimore. See the city from the distance. Alright. Man, I got to use the bathroom. Uh, let's see. Should be getting close though. To the tunnel. But Baltimore seems like a pretty neat neat place to visit though. For like a day or two. Seems like a pretty decent sized city. With a nice harbor. Exits. Right. right lane. You can barely even see the lines on this road. They need to repaint it. Where are that? There's a port right there. This will be my third time going through here. Look at that, that's probably all the salt and stuff they put on the road. Frickin' stocking up for winter. Oh, well, it's already here. Funny how tight these things are. Uh, like tightest things in the world. God damn. Uh, this toll. This is like the probably the tightest toll out of all the tolls I go through. I would probably guess. 
30 feet maybe, maybe 40. So then a big strip can go over it. Yeah, but the first time I went through here, I, I got nervous at the toll because it was so, so small. It's so intimidating at the beginning, but then since it's already my third time, I feel comfortable about it because I've done it before. But yeah, the first time was very like, I kind of almost stopped in the middle of the road because I'm like contemplating if that, if the truck will fit or if it's wide enough to fit in the toll, which it is, but you barely got two inches on each side so you basically got to get it in there perfect without a trail without the trailer being crooked all right but that is pretty much it right there i'm going to i uh, will see you guys in uh Richmond, Virginia at the terminal. See ya. Alright guys, I am almost at the War Ross distribution. I'm gonna drop off this load and then I have to go pick up another one. That's like an hour away. So oh, I get to that one. Oh, I'm a little tired. It's gonna be hard finding parking tonight. Most likely, I tried to get to the terminal in um, South Carolina. We're in, we're in the borders of South Carolina, north to South Carolina right now. But yeah, there is a terminal kind of going towards Atlanta, which just, load after this one is what I'm going to be dropping off. Turn this. You guys can hear me better with the windows up. But yeah, so I've been here before. Not going to lie, the, the guard shack, there was a lady, one, the first time I came, and she was a pretty girl. A mama, a mamacita. Let's see, I gotta merge. I think it's this light coming up. I have to make the turn. After a quarter of a mile turn right. But yeah, I need to need to take a shower. Hopefully I can make it to this terminal. Let's see, I have five hours, eight hours. Well, eight hours. I don't pick it up, so eight. Yeah. Four, five, six. It's gonna be close, I don't know. Unless I can get to a Lowe's, but parking is going to be a royal pain in the butt, I can tell you right now. Especially after, because I have to pick up the slow, the next one after this one, I have to pick up at seven o'clock today. This right afternoon, and that's gonna be horrible. Right at the Finding parking road. after I get that load, which I'm probably gonna end up ending the video after this drop because at nighttime you can't really see anything. Hopefully I can find a a tra uh, empty trailer here too. That's another. I think they'll have one. They they usually have a lot of them of Swift trailers. Don't go, buddy. What the fuck are you doing? All right. Well, I am going to check in, and I will be back with you guys. If you that girl wasn't there, so somebody else working there. She has a nice Mercedes for a guard. <laughs> As a car.
But yeah, I could possibly make it to the terminal after I pick up that second load tonight at 7. I'll have enough time to get there if there's nothing crazy with traffic like there was yesterday. Because that was just insane, heading to Richmond Terminal. But, let's see, that I said... What number was it? Last time I came here, they were painting the numbers, so now they're even better than they were. Because they were so faded, you could barely see anything. Alright, so it seems like the numbers are going up. say like what specific location all it says is oh uh, that's probably a one one seven zero oh maybe yeah there you go so one seven one oh it's gonna be cutting up it's on the other side is it oh i think i see it i think it is on the other side um, one, seven, oh. Uh, I guess we can turn then. Uh, is it going up or down? Wait, one, seven. Seven. Wait, wait. one, seven. Seven one. Um. Oh, wow. I don't even know. This looks like the spot. One seven one zero. The only one I see, so that has to be it. That's where it's gonna go. Let's see. Yeah, that's this guy. Yeah, I didn't ask the guy, screw it. I'm just gonna tell those people inside. Pretty simple one.
Should be good. All right then guys. Well, I'm gonna have to end this video here cause I don't want it to be too long. But hopefully everybody has a good rest of your day and please subscribe if you feel the content is pretty decent. And also I will put my Instagram in the descriptions. So click on it um, and follow me if you want to. Um, but yeah. Hopefully, uh, like I said, hopefully everyone has a good day. See ya.